Our oil and dirt, cooking fat, things like that's in the toil and the uh, tiles in the kitchen. There's no oily residue left there at all. Now, if you're going to do the tiles, what you do is you spray it on and you get a brush. And you're going to brush it over in the lines of what the tiles are. And the reason I'm saying that is you're going to break the skin that's on the outside of the surface. Then it lets the liquid start to penetrate into that surface. Where that comes from. Then it brings the rubbish out with it, and that's why you end up having a cleaner surface like that. Now, I've done it in a shopping centre just in uh, one of the supermarkets, um, service stations where there's common traffic going across there and industrial. Brought the tiles from there. So, you put a bit of that in a bucket of water, or you put it direct? You can dilute that down to a, now if they're really dirty. It's just average. Just average, all right. So we've got some red wine. It's been a good night. You've just gone and spilled red wine all over your car, all over your, um, over your carpet. One of the worst things to try to get is red wine and carpet. Restauranters have told us. Everyone's told us. But, I'll take that red wine out of carpet day in, day out. I'll do the same with food, coffee, pet stains, everything like that. You know, just, I can also use the, the, the gel, the liquid, doesn't matter. It'll still do the same job. So we've used a red wine to clean that application. And that was using that one there. Someone starts talking to me, so I've now spilled the coffee on the carpet. Then they've walked it in, the surface. A bit hard on that surface there because of the light colour, but after a while it was stained. Yeah, you really can't see it too much. If that was the darkest carpet, you could probably see the coffee stain. But I'll remove that. Okay. okay, so we've, we've just spilled some oil in that carpet. Someone's walked in from the outside, they come in, walked into the house and brought some oil with them. You can see it. I'm using the gel one because I don't want it to soak all the way in. I want to grab what's on the top there instead of going in from underneath. With very little effort, there's going to be a little bit of a stain there at first. Without making it too wet. I'm going to take that oil out of that carpet. Where I haven't touched it, I have, there's nothing the other side.